Hey, I am Emily with the Wix Collective, and today I'm here to talk about how to make your Wix website look the most professional and be the most professional so that you can have a successful Wix website. Number one, you need to make sure that your branding is good, okay? This is really deep. Branding is not just a logo. It's not just your business name or your colors. It is the look, the feel, and the sound of your website. So by sound, I mean like the tone of your voice, the words that you use, the consistency of, you know, how you talk about your business, how you relate to your customer or your client or your, you know, your, your viewer, what, who have, whatever you call them how you relate to them is consistent from page to page to page and it's really cohesive so like everything looks like it goes together and everything nothing sticks out like a sore thumb so that can be visual that can also be um being really concise and clear with your wording which leads me to my second point your content so number one your branding needs to be consistent your content needs to be consistent good concise to the point when someone comes to your site and there's like tons and tons of content they're overwhelmed they're leaving they're not going to deal with that right now they have plenty going on in their brains you need to have clear concise content to present to your potential customer to tell them that like hey I am a business or service. I have things under control and I want to guide you to success in whatever service or product that you provide. Okay. So branding is really important. Content is really important. Next is let's just say you need to know how to run the editor. That's the biggest problem that I see. A lot of people, they build a website and they don't know how to use the editor. They don't know how to edit on mobile. They don't know how to structure their content so that it doesn't like jump all over the page and like all mumble jumbly. Um, they don't, they don't know. And so it looks terrible to be completely honest. I've heard from a lot of people like professional people like, Hey, I've seen Wix websites. They don't look good. You know why? Because you don't know how to use the editor. And also another reason is at the bottom of the website, it always says created, proudly created with Wix. Take that off because this is your site. You don't need to have their name on there. You just need to have your name on there. Put your copyright symbol down there. This is yours. This is not Wix's website. This is yours. Okay. So they see this editor or this, um, they see the site that has not been properly laid out. They scroll down and see it made by Wix. They're like, eh, Wix is terrible. It looks terrible. No, learn how to properly utilize the tools in the editor so that you can have a professional looking site. It's not hard. It's just that there's so much that you can do that it becomes overwhelming. So if this is you and you're like, I want to use Wix, I have a Wix site. I don't know how to make it look better, feel better, sound better, brand better, content better. I'm here to help you. I would love to help you. I've been doing Wix websites for nine years. I love it. The platform is so cool. I would love to guide you through this process. Join the Wix Collective. There you can uh, have access to me via Voxer right now. I'm going to be you know, answering your questions via the Walkie Talkie app. We're going to have live Q&As. I can do a site audit for you every month. We can do you can have access to all of my many courses that I currently have. I'm trying to put everything I know about Wix into a bunch of like little mini courses and tutorial videos that are straight to the point, help you work step-by-step -step through the process wherever you're at in your Wix journey to create the most professional website possible so that you can be successful. And hopefully your, I want your Wix websites to just make you tons of money and for it to build your business up. Okay. So those two things can't happen. If you don't have good branding, don't have good content, you don't know how to use the editor and, um, you just feel stuck. Okay. So if you are interested in getting unstuck, join me at the Wix collective.com, join the waitlist if we're not open, but we should be open here shortly. So stay tuned. Okay. Next off is SEO. SEO and the social share image can make you look really unprofessional when it comes to a Wix website. So you need to make sure that you have your search engine optimization in place so that when someone finds you on Google, it doesn't look like um, mumbo jumbo. It looks like really structured content before they click on you. So that means like, you know, like when you Google something and it has little blue words and then it has like little green link below and then it has the description of what page that is below it. And you're like, oh, okay. That's what I want to go to, you know, use your search something on Google, like pink hat for sale. I don't know. 
And then you look through all of those listings and you choose which one you want. That is SEO that gets people up to the top of the page, number one, and also keeps it structured so people know what they're clicking on before they click on it. So make sure that your SEO is good, clean, straightforward, matches your site, and then make sure that your social share images are also in place so that when someone shares a link, it doesn't just say thewixcollective.com and then nothing, but it actually pops up a picture of the front page of your website or your logo or something. And I can help you with all of these things. These are really simple and straightforward and easy to do, but there's just so many options. It's hard to find tutorials on how to do things correctly. So I'd be happy to show you that in the Wix Collective. Just make sure that you have that in place because that is super important, especially if people are going to be sharing your links behind the scenes. Okay. So those are just a few things about how to make your Wix website look more professional. There are so many more things to do, but those are my probably top recommendations for making your site look professional because it is professional if you have those things in place. So if you have any questions, I would love to hear them below. Please share them with me. Otherwise, I hope to see you in the next video. And if you want to join the Wix Collective, check out thewixcollective.com. Thanks for being here.